Hey y'all, it's your girl Jemaya and welcome back to my channel. How you guys doing today? Your girl is doing great. Okay, your girl just got home from a long, 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 long day of work. Okay, it is Friday though, finally the weekend. It is actually Friday the 13th. Crazy, I know. Today was a long day. I'm glad to be home. I am getting my hair done today. I'm getting a retwist. Me and Andrew, I think I'm gonna do two strand twists. This will be my first hair appointment since I hit a year being locked. So I think I'm gonna do two strand twists. That's not originally what I was gonna go with for my one year um style, but I think I'm gonna try two strand twists. Your girl don't ever get styles because I just like my hair down, but we're gonna try it and see see how I like it. My friend Holia is also in town, so I can't wait to see her. I'm gonna go see her tonight after me and Andrew get our hair done and hopefully we can hang out all night and just have a little girls time, you know. I'm really excited. I came on here because I got something from Ulta. So I've been seeing this little lip stain go around on um, TikTok and I looked it up and they had one at Ulta. So I did that instead of getting it delivered to my house. And I'm really excited to try it because if you don't know, your girl got little lips and I like to wear liner. And sometimes I do a little overline, not too much, but because my lips are so small, sometimes I do a little extra just to make it a little more dramatic. So I'm really excited to try this because this is supposed to last all day. Let's see. It says it's supposed to last. Hey, my hand is shaking. Okay, never mind. I don't see where it says how long it's supposed to last, but we're gonna try it anyways. This is the shade Golden Brown, and the brand is called Peel Off Lip Liner Stay In. And this is what it looks like. Again, it is the shade Golden Brown. I'm really excited to try this, and I thought I would try it on camera. I'm also trying it over on my TikTok, so if y'all see me looking down, it's because I'm looking at my phone camera. Trying to see if it lives up to all the hype, you know? This is the container that it comes in. Real cute. I'm gonna look in my mirror to put this on. I'm nervous, hold on. My hand is shaking. All right, I got it on. It says you wait 10 to 15 minutes, let it dry, and then gently peel off film tint to reveal your beautiful lip stain color. So we're gonna wait, we're gonna come back. It's currently 4.46 and we're gonna see how this do. I wanted to try to speed up the process so we got the fan out. All right, so we have went over the time. It is 5.08 and I'm gonna take the little peel off. I've seen some people use tweezers and I've seen some people use their fingers. I have tweezers right here though. Let's see. Look at that. That's crazy. Not that bad i actually kind of like it i feel like i need to fix it a little bit and i've seen like a girl say that you had to like lift your lips and then kind of like set it in place but it's cute and now we just gotta put on some gloss let's see if it's actually like y'all it's not coming <laughs> it's not coming off at all i think i want it to be just a little darker so i'm gonna go on and put another coat on and then come right back because i want to see i want to see if it'll get a little darker if i put another coat on how are you not gonna answer the phone i literally got called in. you don't see my new lip liner mm -hmm. you don't like it <laughs> you don't like it i do like it babe you don't like it stop you don't like it wait do you supposed to put like lipstick or something on it too some gloss you don't you think what why you don't like it babe do you like it you don't like it. People only say that you when like they it. don't like it. Yeah. I like the other one that you did better with. You laughing. That's just me. I'm not laughing. I'm just, I'm just. You're laughing. Does it supposed to be like that? What do you mean? Does it supposed to be like that? Yes. You like it? Yes, I like it. What, if you like it, then I love it. No, you don't. You're a liar. <laughs> I'm just kidding. This is the lip liner, but you peel it off and it's lighter <laughs> underneath. I was like. You didn't like it. You was about to fly and send me out. <laughs> you peel it off. I thought you got it later. You peel it off and then it's a lighter color. I um already did one coat. I thought you, I thought you needed to add something to it. You know, like some, some, like some lip gloss. Nah, I don't want to hear it. Oh. But I'm going to peel it off in a few minutes when it's dry. And then I'll show you what it really looks like. Oh. Alright, I love you. Alright, okay. Bye. Y'all see how he just lied like that? Like he liked it. Don't make no sense. But then was laughing at me. I feel like it's kind of cute, you know? A little dark, but you know, she cute. All right, this is the second pill. I like it. I'm gonna put some gloss on real quick though. Or some chapstick, I'm gonna put some chapstick on. Oh wait, no, I got this. I 
Oh yeah, she cute y'all. It's real cute. And my liner's gonna last all day if I eat or whatever. So I really like that. I feel like, you know, you gotta be careful with this though because if you get it in the wrong spot, you gonna have that little spot right there. That ain't gonna come off, but like, it's cute. Doing what it has to do. So I'm gonna give this a, I'm gonna give it about an eight and a half out of 10. Now I'm gonna eat my nuggets and then wait for Betty to get here so that we can go get our hair done and I will catch up with y'all when we, when we get in the hair fixed. Wrapped around the building twice for some hot donuts. That is crazy. Hey y'all, happy Sunday. So I never came back and showed y'all my retwist on Friday. That's because it was so late and I was so tired by the time I get back home. But yep, girl, your girl got her hair retwisted. It's looking real cute, real clean and fresh, okay? And then um, I didn't get the two strand twist, as you can see. That's because of the appointment being so late, it would have just took a lot longer to do. So we decided to wait and we'll do the two strand twist for the next appointment next month. So we just got a basic bust down middle part, you know. <laughs> But I'm ready because I'm about to go see my best friend. This is her last day in town before she has to fly back home. She was in town for a funeral this weekend and I got to spend some time with her. And y'all, I got some amazing news. Can y'all see this? I was asked to be the godmother of my best friend's baby. This says, pairs well with becoming godmother. It takes a village and I'm so grateful you're in mine. Y'all, I bawled like a baby, okay? And then she also got this wine glass that came with it and it just says, Godmother established 2024. Look how freaking cute. No one's allowed to drink out of this glass except for me. But um, yeah, I am now officially Lauren's Godmother. I'm really excited, really thankful, really blessed. I feel so honored to be able to be Lauren's Godmother and also just the friendship that I have with Halia. And even if she didn't choose me to be her Godmother, I would not have cared because I still love her and I love that baby, okay? So I was just fine with just being an Amy but here we are so now I have two god babies my niece Emery is also my god child and now my best friend's baby is my god child so he just caught me god mommy Yana, okay <laughs> but yeah like I said I was in that thing crying y'all messing up my makeup yesterday like I'm too emotional for stuff like this I bawled my eyes out when Kayla asked me to be Emery's god mom I just I do not take these things lightly I am so emotional and I truly 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 love all of the kids so it's like I just feel so so blessed but again i'm gonna go see halia today before she leaves i'm excited i don't know what we're gonna do probably just hang out i want to see if she wants to go get some ice cream because i kind of want some ice cream and hopefully i can take you all with me and you know y'all can see her before they go i got on my lip liner today the stain y'all i'm obsessed this is the third day i've worn it and i'm really liking it. i think this is the best that i've put it on so far and y'all it lasts all day long like i was out all day yesterday and literally was still on you literally have to like wash your face for it to come off because if you just rub it with your finger or if you're eating or drinking or whatever it will still be there i'm gonna recommend it a 10 out of 10 i changed my rating from before because it is it is great i just hate the waiting time which is why i gave it the i think it was the eight and a half that i gave it the last time but it's growing on me <laughs> but i'm gonna get off here and hopefully i'll see y'all once i'm with halia and baby lauren Besties for the resties. <laughs> hey y'all, what's up? Happy Tuesday. So your girl is about to head to go eat for my best friend's granny's birthday. And I stopped at Bath & Body Works first. I only came to Bath & Body Works because my mom wanted me to pick up some of these little um, car freshener things. Y'all, I got like... Yeah, I think I got like 12 of them for her because she's a member and so like she got like a discount. She got these things for like a dollar something y'all. So I got her like 12 and plus I got her a new like the little car freshener things to put in your car. You can put it on the top or you can put it in your vent. So I got her that. And y'all this freaking, which one was it? Hold on, hold on, hold on. This mahogany coconut baby. 
Dang, you can't smell through the paper. It smells so freaking good. I told her I'm taking one of these because, baby, when I say it smells so good, y'all, I've never even had this scent before. I'm going to have to buy some candles like this because, five. But I got Julie's granny a Bath & Body Works gift card since it is her birthday. I just got her like a $10 gift card because she likes little candles. Um, And I didn't know what else to grab her. So we're about to go eat some Mexican food. I can't wait to get this Pollo Loco, baby. I might even get me a little burrito, okay? We were supposed to all be there at 6.30 and it's 6.51, so I really need to hurry up and stop doing all this dang talking. But I wanted to update y'all and say happy Tuesday. <laughs> and I am just obsessed with this lip liner, y'all, because as you see, your girl got it on again. I didn't wear it to work or anything, but as soon as I got home, put that hoe on, that way, ready for the night. I'm gonna go because I want to get there close to when everybody else is getting there. I think T says she was about to be there, so I don't wanna be like the last one to show up. I'm gonna hit the road and I will see y'all I might record at the restaurant. I don't know. We'll see. Happy what you doing, little monster? <laughs> you can't jump over this, girl. Can we pull you over? Hey, y'all. What's up? It is currently late thursday night fresh 8 1 p.m and i'm tired i just did my whole nighttime skincare routine because i feel like i haven't done one of those for y'all in a while it'll be in short form content but i figured i had to do it anyway so i might as well record it okay i had stopped using my little kojic acid um face wash bar but i recently started back using it to get rid of like hyperpigmentation i just was not consistent but i need to do better again your girl is getting mad Oh, I thought I lost my ring. It's sitting right here. Your girl is getting married <laughs> next October. And I really want to lock in on like the dark spots, you know, the health journey, all those kind of things. Because I want to look my absolute best for the best day of my life. You know what I'm saying? So I started back using that. And we're going to really try to monitor, monitor it this time. There's a gnat. Do y'all see that gnat? Oh, it's about to drive me crazy. I hate, hate when the gnats are out to play. But yeah, I'm going to try to monitor it a little better. Though I can give y'all accurate updates on it. I feel like I've been pretty, you know, motivated to hop on the camera lately. So I thought I would just show y'all something a little normal in my life. Again, I didn't record it on here. I don't know what I was thinking, but I did make like a little short, a little TikTok video of it. And that'll be uploaded probably before this video. But anyways, yeah, it's late, tired, and I am already ready for bed. Cause your girl's got her face clean, I'm showered, my teeth are brushed, and we done the dang thing. I have no idea. What we're eating tonight. I'm not really that hungry because I ate when I got off work. So Andrew might be on his own tonight when it comes to whatever we eat. But I'm hot. You know, like right after a very hot shower and everything, like I just I need some air. But I'm just kind of like cleaning up my little mess that I made here, trying to do my little routine. Uh I kind of cleaned up the bathroom a little today, like not like fully like washed down the shower and everything, but I did clean up like the sink area because we had stuff everywhere, baby. Everywhere. And who do you think the stuff was? Mine? No. It was Andrews, but you know, hey, hey, they said girls are messy. No, 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 no. <laughs> I just wanted to come on and talk to you guys for a minute. You know, I was thinking how the Me Too movement is coming up um, in October and I'm trying to think if I want to share my story or not. I feel like I've always wanted to talk about it, but the most important people in my life didn't know about what happened to me. And now that they do, I feel like I feel a little more okay with telling it to the world. I mean, there's still some close people in my life that don't know. This is probably me recording. It will probably be the first time that they ever hear about it. But like, I'm just ready to say my piece and move on my life. And I feel like this is going to be a helpful part of moving on for myself. So, still thinking about it. We're still in September, so you know. Who knows what I'll think by the time October gets here, if I want to share that or not. I just thought that October would be the perfect time to share that kind of story, considering that it is the movement for me too. If y'all know what Me Too movement is, look it up. But yeah, like I said, it's late. I'm hot. I'm getting thirsty. Go drink me some water and I'm going to get my butt in the bed. I got to put my hair scarf on because we don't, we don't sleep. We don't sleep on the hair like this, okay? Always wrap your hair up. Protect it at all costs. This is your crown, baby. Clearly it's late because I am just rambling. So I'm going to go. I'll catch y'all tomorrow. Can we can we get into that lock growth though? Like, can we get into it? Baby, what? Like, look at this. Look, hold on. Let's get into it. Get into it, get into it. Like, can we just like get into it? Look at that, y'all. Luscious, beautimous. Look at that. I am very much obsessed. Okay, I'm finished. 
Happy Sunday, you guys. Your girl is getting ready to head out the door because I am going to a gender reveal today and I'm so excited. The thing is, I already know the gender, but they don't know that I know the gender. And I know the gender because the girl having it is my best friend's sister who is best friends with my little brother who told my little brother, who told my sister, who told me. That makes sense? Y'all keep up with that. So again, I already know the gender, but I'm still really excited. My best friend is about to pick me up and we are gonna head down there because it's like 30 minutes away from where we're at. So trying to hurry up because we're supposed to leave at one and it's 103. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and also do not forget to subscribe to your girl's channel if you haven't already. Okay, I love you guys so, so, so very much and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.